Hello everyone and welcome to my Radiography Masterclass. In this brand new course, I'm going to take you through a comprehensive series of modules covering every body region that will take you from a beginner to a level of a qualified radiographer. I'm really excited to finally have this released to you all as I've been working on it for nearly a year. There's a lot to learn and take in here, but I think what you'll find is that it isn't in any way overwhelming as I'll take you through each of the modules step by step ensuring you've understood everything before you move on to the next idea. I've specifically designed each module with you, the student, in mind. I was a radiography student myself not long ago, so I know what key ideas, terms, and concepts you find difficult. In this masterclass, I'll be taking you through everything you need to know as a diagnostic radiography student, where medical, physiotherapy, and nursing students will also find it beneficial. In the first module, I'll start off by showing you the anatomy in 3D covering the bones and joints so you're familiar with the context of what we're dealing with for that body region. In the second module, I'll introduce the radiography for that region, that is what the standard and miscellaneous projections are, what a normal x-ray looks like, when you would take, exclude or add projections and their justifications for it, covering any pediatric considerations, and then talking about where you would take them in addition to the centering points for each view and what to include to acquire a diagnostic image. Then at that point when you know what a normal x-ray looks like, in the third module I'll show you what abnormal looks like by taking you through the common pathologies you would expect to see in that region. Where I first discuss the abnormal pathology conceptually and then you'll see me draw and identify them on an x-ray so you see it visually for yourself. Then in the fourth module, I take you to the x-ray room and show you how to position a patient live for all of the different x-ray projections introduced in the second module. I'll show you how they're done effectively, covering a lot of tips and tricks I've learned over the years, in addition to things like room preparation, exposure selection, infection control procedures, and what to do when the patient leaves the x-ray room. Essentially, a comprehensive look at what you'll need to do when you're on clinical placement or if you're a practicing radiographer. In the fifth module, we take all that you've learned and use that to critique the quality of some poorly taken radiographs. So you'll be able to know how to correct the positioning and technique just by looking at the x-ray. And then finally, in the sixth module, I'll be putting you to the test by asking you a lot of questions ranging from a number of MCQs, to finding and identifying different pathologies covered, to evaluating clinically urgent findings and what you need to do when you see something that needs attention. And if by the time you've finished just watching the very first module of this series, which is on the hands, fingers and thumb, which by the way, I'm offering to you completely for free, and you aren't a little better equipped clinically with your enhanced knowledge of the anatomy, radiography, and patient positioning, then I shall consider this series to be a total failure as far as you're concerned. But if that's the case, then I would love to hear your feedback on how I can improve this delivery. For the great aim of education is not knowledge, but action. So as you can see, there's a lot that this masterclass includes, and I think you'll get a lot of value out of it. And most importantly, you'll have fun while doing it. So you literally have nothing to lose. Now click here to watch that first module on the hands, fingers and thumb. I'll see you there.